do 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 just casually waiting for my apartment to burn down. Hey my little puppies, it's Perfect Girl here, back in our video, and today I am back playing some Royal High School. So you may notice my surroundings are different today, and that is because there was a huge update that came out in Royal High, and it is so cool, so I thought I would show it off to you guys today. So if you didn't know, um, some leaks have been going around recently that we are going to get some apartments in Royal High, and is that update has come so today i'm going to show you everything there is to know about the new apartments and uh yeah but before i get into the apartment update i'm just going to show you some mini updates that came really quickly so um there were some new hairs added rosie has been adding in a lot of hairs to the game recently which i think is really cool so this one's called voluminous queen this one's where's my water ball this one I really like, um, Braided Bun Beauty. I really like that. This one is Glamour XO, so it's like a little ponytail. Actually, I really like that. It's pretty realistic. And then we have Sweet Ponies and Sweetie. These are a little bit crazy, but, um, I like it. So those are the new hairs that were added, and along with those, we got two new bangs the new hairs we got. Um, but we also got some new animations so understanding poses there is chill world cute hiding hands hands on hips my hands are kind of uh in my skirt <laughs> uh, and it's also confident spotlight blush i really like this one and yeah and then for sitting poses you have side relax oh Elevator doors just close on me. Okay. Anyways, we have side relax. It's really hard to show you these in the elevator, uh, but there's also yoga sit, sunburn, knees, and cute gazing. Really like these as well. And then under silly, we have backbend and zombie. We don't have any new dances, uh, but there's a new section called friends. So there's some new um, two person poses. So there's high five left and high five right. I can't really show you what these poses look like because I don't have anybody with me right now. There's also left hold and right hold. And there's also buddies left and buddies right. Walking left, walking right. And the left heart and right heart poses, which we've had for a little while now. So yeah, those are all the mini updates that have come, which I think is really cool. So now it is time to show you the brand new apartments and let me just tell you they are amazing so you already saw the little elevator bit but when you walk out oh ah, so i'm gonna give you a little grand tour here it says quite gamers place and then you can actually there are a lot of light switches so you can actually turn it off and on the lights in here we have a little closet area with a sleeping bag and i'll i'll get to that in a little bit and we also have a paint bucket and so basically this is where you can just choose your favorite color and that will basically just change around the items in the house like these are pink because i chose pink as my favorite color so yeah and then um if i go down these stairs let me start with the bedroom how nice is this this is so fancy and amazing so here we have a little fireplace over here and a little window seat which I love I love window seats in real life so now my character can have one in her apartment and this is really nice look at the amazing view it's snowing outside so that's really cool and then here is my bed over here this looks so comfy and I can actually sleep and um, basically there's this new needs type thing and in your cell phone under your missions you can actually see your needs um are, my energy is pretty low right now so i can actually sleep and that will fill up and my volume is currently low but if i turn it up you're gonna hear my character snoring so that's pretty funny and the more you sleep like some clouds come in which i think is super cool 
And then, once your sleep gets up to 100%, you will get rewarded with diamonds. So, that is so cool. And then here you can turn off the lights and stuff as well. Whoa, that looks so cool. Anyways, in here, we have a little computer desk area. And this thing is so cool. Okay, so, if I go on it, my character will type in their little passcode. And you will actually get a login reward. Now, I already did this, but basically you will get uh, your daily 100 diamonds. So every day you come in and roll high, log on to your computer, and you will get 100 diamonds. How cool is that? And then another super cool thing. So in the update description, Barbie says that this thing is called the Royella. So if I click on it, as you can see, we have a whole playlist of songs. So let me turn up my volume real quick. And there's no song actually playing right now, but I can choose from all these songs. And these, well, these are Christmas songs currently, but there's Joy to the Piano. So that's really cool. There's also Jingle Bells. <laughs> yeah, this is pretend to Christmas songs. You can also add your own song. So I haven't actually tested this out yet, but let me go grab a song real quick. So if you go into the Roblox library and go under audio, you can actually find a bunch of audios that people put on. So let me find a song real quick. Once you choose your song, you're going to go up here and copy the ID of the song. And then if I click add song and I paste the ID in here, click add. And let me see if this actually worked. Um, okay, it's not here, so I guess it didn't work. Uh, let me choose a different song maybe. Let's try this again. Ah, here we go. So I chose It's Raining Tacos. Okay, I'm just gonna stop that there because I don't want to get copyrighted, but that's really cool So you can play your own songs and you can just roam around your apartment listening to your song So that's awesome. And then if I go over here, we will go into the living room slash kitchen Now this is Amazing look at this huge couch and you can actually do a bunch of different poses and um, There's a lot of places to sit on the couch I can even sit up here if I really wanted to. So if you have a ton of friends over, um, you know, you can all sit on the couch because there's a ton of places to sit. So it's really cool. And I have my very own Christmas tree, which is so cute. And then here is my very pink kitchen. I love it so much. It's so nice. And there's actually something really funny that you can do in the kitchen that I'm going to show off at the end of the video. So stay tuned until the end because that's where I'm going to do this. But, you know, you can interact with different things. You can turn on the oven and the stove and the microwave and stuff. You can't actually cook anything in here. Not that I know of, at least. I could be wrong, but it's still really cool. Over here, you have a pantry. And most of the stuff you can't actually grab from here. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. Um, it would be really cool if I could actually get food from here, but that is okay. I can, however, grab this kettle. Now, let me show you what you can do with this. So, currently, the kettle is empty, and I can just go and place it around. You might be thinking, okay, this is just for decoration. You can just have a kettle there, but it's actually not. You can actually make drinks in this kettle. So, what you're going to do is you're going to put the kettle in your sink, and then you're going to turn on the water. And as you can see, it says it's filling. And you wait for it to say full. And now it is full, so I can grab the kettle and you're now you're gonna place a kettle on your little stove over here and you're going to turn it on and then now it says heating and you're going to wait for it to say boiling so now it is boiling and if i actually turn up my volume it will make this very beautiful sound yeah and then you click on the kettle and you can either make hot chocolate or tea and now i'm gonna make some hot chocolate because it is Christmas time. So I don't know if you guys remember, but last year there was actually a cho hot chocolate making thing as well. And it is back, but it looks a little bit different now. So you have a ton of different flavors to choose from. I'm going to choose candy cane hot chocolate because that just sounds really good. And then I'll ask you if you want whipped cream on your hot chocolate. I mean, yeah. Yes, I want marshmallows. Yes, I want a candy cane. Yes, I want a cookie straw. And here is my hot chocolate done. It looks more realistic than it did last year. So let's go ahead and take a sip. Mmm, this is so good. Seriously though, I want this in real life. This looks delicious. 
But yeah, so you can just sip on your hot chocolate, which I think is really cool. So that's it for the kitchen. Now, if I go back upstairs, um, I will head into the bathroom, which is so nice. This is just a little hallway area where I can grab some body towels and some head towels. And then here is the bathroom it is huge and so fancy so over here you can turn on the faucet or you can grab a toothbrush and i'll be here brushing my uh face my chin <laughs> and then let's put on a body towel i'll choose pink there we go and then let me put on a head towel as well also in pink and here we go, my kitty ears are poking out. So now I am ready to hop in the bath. First of all, I can actually turn on the bathtub lights and then the bathtub water will change colors from blue to green, which I think is really cool. And then I can light up these candles as well and I can just relax and enjoy the view. Seriously, how cool would this be in real life to just bathe and look at the city? That would be amazing. And then if I get out, there's a little area over here where I can do my makeup. Now, this is actually really cool. You can interact with a lot of stuff. So first of all, I can spray on some perfume. And then I can actually click on a lot of the makeup items. Like I can put on some lipstick. And I can also click on the mascara here and put on some of that. And I can also put on some blush as well. I can literally like interact with almost everything, which I think is amazing. And then I can also put on some moisturizer, which I think is really cool. And some skin mist, whatever that is, but that's really cool as well. And now my face is sparkling. <laughs> and then we have the uh, toilet room. The very scary toilet room, I might add. Like what... Why would you want this in your bathroom? This is just scary. So I think that's all for the bathroom. And then once you are done with your towels, you can put them back in this little hamper. Now there's one more thing I'm going to show you before I get into the um, epic ending. So, um, you can actually go in your friend's apartment. Now, I don't really have anybody to uh, show you that. I'm not sure if this is the only way to get into other people's apartments, but this is the only way I know how to. Um, basically, if your friend is online in their apartment, you can follow them through the phone, and then you'll be inside of their apartment, which I think is really cool. But that is actually why we have a sleeping bag here. I can get this little sleeping bag, and if I have a friend over, I can like put it right here. And I can actually hold down my mouse to rotate it. And then now there's a little sleeping bag here so you can have your friends over and you can have a sleepover, which I think is so cool. But um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I have shown you everything that you can do in the apartment. Um, if I missed anything, then let me know in the comments. But there is one more thing I need to show you. You can actually burn down your apartment. Yeah, you heard me. You can burn down your apartment. Now this is how you do it. First of all, you just turn on um, all the lights on your stove. And then what you do next is you turn on your oven and open the door. And then you turn on the microwave and open the door. And just wait patiently for it to happen. It will happen eventually. Do, 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 do. Just casually waiting for my apartment to burn down. My laptop needs to charge, but I don't want to go get the core because then I'll miss my apartment burning down. I'm just gonna be. I'll be right back. I'm just gonna. Oh, whoa! Oh no! It happened. Oh gosh! Yep. Here we go. Oh wow! 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 That's a. That's one big fire. Okay, but trust me, it gets a lot worse. <laughs> it spreads. Yep, there we go. Oh my gosh. It's spreading everywhere. My beautiful couch. Oh no. Oh gosh, it's coming near me. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, no, no. <gasps> my bed. Oh my gosh, my poor apartment. No. Wow, okay. That is, this is some big fire. And I actually don't get hurt from it at all, so that's interesting. Now you're probably wondering how to actually fix a fire. Now I'm not actually sure. Oh, it spread to the bathroom too. Oh wow. 
Um, it was really cool. Some like firefighters came here and this extinguished the fire, but they don't. I'm not sure if everything. I'm not sure if the fire goes away eventually. So yeah, like I said, I'm not really sure how to fix this. Um, if you guys know, then let me know in the comments. But the only way I know how to get rid of it is to just take the elevator back down to Earth and then come back. Okay, so I'm back in Earth now. So now if I click on the teleport button, I should be able to go back to my apartment. Yep, here we go. And now my apartment is completely back to normal. So yeah, that's the only way I know how to fix it. If you guys know another way, then let me know in the comments. But yeah, that is everything you need to know about the new apartments. Okay, so that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments if I have missed out on any of the apartment features. This is just everything that I know about it so far. I'm excited to see if any updates will be coming to these apartments in the future. Let me know in the comments what videos you think I should film in my apartment. They can be normal video ideas or roleplay ideas. Just any videos that you think I should film in my apartments, then let me know in the comments. I would love to hear your suggestions. If there is anything that you want me to see, then make sure to tag me in it on Twitter or Instagram. My username for both of those is puppygirl underscore Mia, and they will be linked in the description. And yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!